Hello, Shrop Shalad here again. Today I've made these Brathurst, made out of venison, which is a bit of a change from the usual pork. We've got some lovely onions that have been cooked in beer, and then we've, with the beer we've made a cheese sauce, we Shropshire Blue and butter. You're gonna absolutely love this one. Let's go. Right then, so today I'm gonna have a go at making these venison Brathurst. So they're normally a German thing, Brathurst, but these are gonna, the only thing that's German about these is the idea of Brathurst. The rest of it is gonna be Shropshire produce. So we've got some wonderful venison here, which is shot on the Reekin, just a couple of miles away. Uh, venison is very, very lean, so we're going to add to that some streaky bacon, smoky streaky bacon, which has also been ground down. Uh, and then we're going to add some juniper, some uh, allspice, and some um, rose pepper as well into that. And some probably a little bit of rosemary and some garlic. Right, so this is a sausage maker. I haven't used it for a little while, but you can pick them up online, 40, 50 quid, and it means you can make any amazing combination of sausages you want. So perfect piece of kit to have for anybody who loves a sausage. So what we're going to do is the meat that we've put the, with the uh, that we've put together there is going to go into the hopper. It gets wound through. This is electric, so I'll turn this on in a minute. And it gets pumped through here. And then this is uh, hog casing. So you can pick this up from your butchers, a couple of quid, um, and it'll make endless sausages, more sausages than you can eat. So I'm going to have it, give it a go. So excuse the noise. I'm going to turn it on. And we're going to add. A little bit of meat to the top. Now I have to use this little baton to work it in. Now you'll notice that I haven't tied the ends because we have the air balls appearing as we first start to bump it through. You don't want any air in your sausages. So as I work this meat through, I'm going to wait until we see it start to appear. And there we are, sorted. Brathurst. These need to chill for an hour or so in the fridge. I'm going to get some, a beer bath going on on the Kadai. I'm going to cook them all up in the beer, make some onions, and then we're just going to eat them. It's going to be amazing. Let's go. So we're going to make a beer butter bath to cook these bratwurst in though. So I'm going to use some beer to start with. I'm going to drop that into this uh, kadai bowl. I'm just going to just sit over the flames. Probably going to have to use a couple of these bottles, I think. There's one. Then into that, I'm going to add three small onions. Some 
butter. Probably about uh, 150 grams of butter, I'd say. I'm gonna let that cook down. Um, and once they start, so once the heat comes through and that's sort of just simmering, I'm gonna drop the uh, sausages in there and poach them a little bit. And uh, once they're cooked in there, we'll just finish them off on the grill here. And we're gonna turn this into a delicious cheesy sauce to go on the top of the beer brats. Right, now this is sort of the temperature of a hot cup of tea, not boiling. You don't want it to be boiling because if it's boiling, it's gonna split your skins. You don't want split skin. So we're gonna drop these in there and they're gonna just poach away about half an hour, something like this. All that wonderful buttery beer and onions is gonna make these super succulent and poaching them means they're gonna be super juicy when we finish them off as well. And that's all them in there. So half an hour or so, and then poaching away in that liquor, and then we're gonna finish them on the grill so they get a nice charred finish. Right, so these have been poaching for about half an hour now. The smell coming off it is just like unreal. Uh, what we're gonna do is drop these brats down onto the grill now to finish them off. Try not to take too many sausages, uh, sorry, too many onions. Get these down on the coals. That venison is incredible. You gotta try these. Really good.